Welcome back to Night of the Dead. It is wave 73. Um, I've uploaded day 72 and wave 72. Uh, recorded day 73, further building on the uh, uh, new roller coaster base. Uh, it's well, you'll, if, if you want to go and watch it, uh, it's uh, or if you've already watched it, uh, uh, it's a little bit frustrating. Um, I've put things up, tear things down. Uh, you can fall from six stories up. You do take about five fall damage, so five health blocks uh, doing it. So I wouldn't recommend doing it on a regular basis. I went through a wee bit of food <laughs> on the build. Uh, yeah, so we're back in here for wave 73. Uh, let me know your thoughts on the build. Um, should I cut out more? Do you like how much I'm leaving in there? And uh, yeah, it'll, because uh, that'll uh, dictate how I go forward with it. If it's not getting many views or nobody's kind of commenting or liking it, then you know, it, it's, I, you know, I'll cut some out. Uh, and we'll go from there. So the wave started. They have been coming in from over here. I uh, let myself get a little bit distracted last wave and I made a bit of a mistake. I didn't have things ready and upgraded in time. And you know, we actually got two bags down here. So they got further. I was a little late getting the fuel in for the zero wave, or sorry, the two wave to the final wave, and uh, won't let that happen again. I did kind of close this in. Um, in case you're wondering, I've closed this in. The reason for it, I kept coming down, and that was I put those ones in because those kept getting damaged from exploders there. I put that one in because this wall in because that crafting bench kept getting damaged by exploders. So rather than take a chance of losing, where is it coming from? So it is coming from the same area. Yep. That's kind of cool. You can see them coming down the hill. Okay. Now, I did get the last daytime wave. They did thin out this a little bit. Um, and there's the screen. I just thought it, ah, I'm going to change that to a bridge so I can see, we can see in there. Oh, I got boss mode already. even already. Uh, it's because there's a butcher in here as well. So the bosses make a different sound. So when they're getting hit or knocked around, let's see, where's the butcher? Is it going to come up here? Yep, here comes the butcher. Did we get by that? Nope, didn't make it by the second boss kill. So the deeper sound you hear is that green guy. So if you get a few bosses in, like we do at the end of the wave, you get a completely different sound in the cutters.
And it's one of the ways that you, know, you can tell what's going through your traps without having to be able to actually see them. So yeah, if I make that, a, I can, oh. You get something in mind, you can kind of just... Oh, that trap's not working this time. That's not good. I think the boss made it down there. Oh, here it comes. It's the butcher. Now it's turning good. Now here, if a jumper does come, I can get hit. The one thing is, is if they come up, all they're going to do is just... Okay, let's go up and over. Let's see what we've got down here. That's two. That's four. That's okay. That's eight. Kind of moving slowly tonight. Have an exploder coming by. And it should make it by there, and it did, because there's no explosion yet. And there's the explosion. Now we need to start being concerned about damage to the traps as the exploders are coming through. Is that it? That's 11. That's stuck here for a little bit. I'm always a little concerned.
Get off my dick. I'm always a little concerned when uh, there's a lull like that. Kind of like the game's just saying, oh, you think it's going to be okay? So that's why I can't really go very far forward on this. I uh, engage the jumpers. If I put a wall there, I could do it, but I went with the fence instead. An exploder. Let's load that up now. Just me, or again, does this night seem quite... Where are the big guys coming from? There's going to be a stream on coming in soon. Whoa, that was not a good thing to jump over. Not that it really matters where they're coming from. Here they come. I was wondering if that was ever going to happen to me. Not a good time for some of these traps to stop working. See that one's not rotating. That one's not rotating. Can I work? I load it up, does it? get to some of these traps. That sounds like that explosion is coming from a little further back. That now I can get to it. Did that work? Oop, nothing seems to have gone that far.
and it's gotten quiet. Oh, we just have the crawlers coming in now. Let's just make sure that takes care of them. Yeah, I can't access this trap. Now, finally. That is a bit of an annoying thing on the cutters, is that you can't access them. So how far did they get? Well, that looks like it just took damage alone. That only took damage. Wow. That only took damage. That took one. That did twice. I think I ended up reloading that just because I was trying to access a... Uh, a different trap. Now we should be getting the uh, first daytime wave shortly. And at that point we'll let it come in. So yeah, I can... Oh, that was just silly. Let's just do this now. Rebar and ingot. Let's go get a rebar. I can just do it from here. Easy enough. Uh, rebar, plates, nails. hoping that the first daytime wave would be coming in. That took one? Wow. Makes me wonder if, some, if one doesn't wander in this way. So that just took damage. That spiked floor had 87 of 100 left. place to be Not if a zombie shows up however not much different than a my multi-platform base Okay, so they didn't get very far. I think that trap door that's over there, or trap floor, or 
um, what are they called? <laughs> Special trapdoor. The trapdoor that got uh, triggered over there, I think it had more to do with, because I've noticed the odd zombie runs down this way. They come in here and then they go out and I wonder if they run underneath this, if it doesn't trigger it kind of like when they run around outside here and they set off other traps. Because the fact that nothing else got triggered anywhere out here to me really indicates that. Oh, I sorry, I got a double, good double foundation in there. I had to raise the uh, that up a bit so it could fire through the door. Okay. Well, thank you again for watching. Uh, I appreciate it. If you want, like, comment, share, subscribe. <laughs> You know, you guys know the routine. I don't know if I'm really trying to grow the uh, channel. I'm just having fun doing what I'm doing right now. If the channel grows, all the better. Um, so yeah, thank you. And I will see you on the daytime 74 if you want to watch the build or night wave 74. Cheers.